Right, hello and welcome back to Company of Heroes 3 on the Italian campaign. We are pretty much ready to just end the turn now. And we'll see what the enemy does in response to all this. They're definitely trying to break out of here. I'm surprised they haven't sent units down to here and here. They're down to like a test and uh, our port over there. But... It is what it is. Right. I think we'll close this pocket on the west now with the paratroopers, the artillery and then the armour coming up from the south. We should be able to close this pocket. Um, yeah, ah, they are. We're going to say I'd be surprised if they keep all those troops up there. It's Surely they're not going to. And yeah, they're not going to. Surprise, surprise, they're moving out. Okay. Gives me an opportunity though. The German tank you provided us recently has proven very useful in pushing the enemy out of our towns. Thank you again for the support. Well, look at that. Is there anything in range that this could... Use capture target on. I don't think there is, isn't there? No. It was both garrisoned, so it's not that useful for me, really. Um, looks like the Germans are going to start attacking these, so... Yeah, we've got all this to stop up here. Right. They're going to heal. Then they're going to attack these. We can auto resolve. Because, yeah, there's no way they beat me there. Done. Okay. We've still got paratroopers behind the line. And we are going to have to do something about the stampede of armor coming down through there. Um. Let's get some attacks on these. Um, sure. I'm going to put a repair on as well after that. Right, let's get a march on. We can get all the way up there. Ow. Okay. Movies down. Looks like they're going to get away. But it doesn't matter too much. They're out of moves now. If I put that, yeah, there we go. Um, Let's get Jerry a greeting that he ain't never gonna forget. I guess in that case they'll swap positions and we'll. Anyway, we're gonna be pushing through here with those. So good stuff. Right. That leaves us with what to do with these. Let's hit these on the road. Looks like our... Yeah. For whatever reason, we apparently do an absolute ton of damage to these units. Don't know why we're getting such a favourable auto-resolve. 
Maybe it's because we're attacking from the trees or something? Perhaps? No idea. But we're hitting them hard. Right. Okay. I think that's all of them. Yeah. Everyone's moved. Oh. Oh no, hang on, hang on, hang on. We have... New armoured division up here. Ah, hello. Excellent. Smash them. <laughs> Listen up, we got orders. So we need a few things bought on these. Get these fully done up. There we go. Full attachments. Well, detachments, sorry. Um, and what can we get? Ooh, we can get a combat group. Deploys an easy eight with a rifleman squad escort. Or we can upgrade it to replace the rifleman with another easy eight. Uh, yes. <laughs> Ooh, or we can go battle hardened. The easy eight will arrive with veterans of three and some assault engineers. I don't know if the assault engineers are in addition to the rifleman, but... Double up, obviously, for that one. Absolutely, yes. We can't purchase it yet. Ooh, I won't mind the howitzer as well. Oh, and a recovery vehicle. I like this division. I really like this division. Ooh. Additional fuel. We can get Thompson's. Uh, friendly vehicles will fuel 50% of their fuel costs upon cost upon death. Okay, so this is just Sherman spam. That's what this combat group uh, group is. It is just spam Shermans. <laughs> what do these get us as well? These attachments have got uh, construct supply crates, use encirclement, and construct howitzers. But more importantly, they give you a combat group's additional strength when calculating auto resolves, which is really what I bought them for. Um, on that note, that means we'll also have... Hello? Yeah, I think we'll probably still send the artillery after those, but now... Let's see... Now we'll get the howitzers. We can't afford anything else with the manpower at the moment that we've got, so let's start pushing up here. And now we're starting to put some pressure on these. Okay, excellent stuff. Right. We'll be done with all this soon enough. toward the mighty winter line. They can smell your fear in Rome. Turn back now. Right. Send some planes out on recon, aren't they? Mechanized units rolling out. Some paratroopers up there then it looks like looks like they might be concealing themselves in the trees next to the roads, possibly. And well, they're going in for an attack. I'm gonna have to fight that out. Hmm. Right. Well on that note. 
Let's see what this uh, new armoured division can do. When our next lot of uh, manpower comes in, we can bolster this thing up, though. But until then, yeah, we're going to have to fend them off. Though the extra forces up near this port should allow us to finally start pruning away at them. Right, it's a defence one, so this should be pretty easy, actually. Running dry on reinforcements, so make sure those strong points are defended. Only dictionaries, eh? Staffers on site. What did he blow it up? Flamethrower duty. Davin, you're up. Pack it up, engineers. We're moving. Roger that. Let's get started. Quite lively, men. All right, we're on it. Right. Armoured car as well this time. Don't normally get one of those, but sure. Bad positioning on the MG. I prefer it when it's looking down here. Or if it's down looking there. Hmm. Right. Oh. This could be an interesting little exploit. Right, this will drop fuel crates. No, I said, all right, I'm going to say, I don't know why the flares were over there. Okay, right. How much do we get? 30 and 30, so that should be 60 fuel. Nearly. We can nearly get one. <laughs> Supplies aren't making it back to HQ. Lines cut. Get him! Get him! Get him! Right, that seems to be working. Right. Get him. Uh oh, don't run, run, run. Those are there. That's a problem. Ow, 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 ow. Get a grenade in there. Someone, please. Please, now. Yes, got him. Uh, reinforce quick. Blast him. Ready 
That's a point. Um, what have we got? Uh, blast around there. Ish. No, go go forward and grab that. Grab that. Should have got a bit dice for a moment. <laughs> for a moment. <laughs> that's interesting though. You can call some fuel in. Hmm. That's definitely you. You could mess with certain. Um, you could definitely mess with certain defense maps and things and skirmish maps with that. You know, the ones where it's like, okay, you only have these units and have to destroy these three points. Just call in a bunch of fuel, and then you can start using the call-in abilities to get additional tanks. <laughs> of course, you've only limited manpower, so, you know, it's... It would be instead of reinforcements for your troops, basically. But, opens up some opportunities, I think, that. Should be an interesting uh, battalion to play with this. Right. We'll send them all in. And hopefully, yeah, between these and the special forces, we'll hopefully start knocking out some of the units around the port. If we can just take a few of the units out, we should start rolling over it in no time. We need to pick which ones we're going to attack, though. We want to go for the... Ones that have weakened themselves on me at the moment. The Special Forces Company seems to be particularly good in the auto resolve against the tanks, so we should use that against those. And then maybe the armour against the infantry. Mm. That seems to be how it. I'm thinking that might be how it's calculated. Maybe it considers the special forces to be, you know, special anti-tank units or something for auto-resolve purposes. Not quite certain, but if it's ever telling us that it's going to not go our way, we can always, of course, just, you know, go ahead and fight it ourselves. So, always the option. But yeah, we're looking more and more like now we can just push through to that winter line we just got again a few little pockets to close and then we'll be pushing a big front toward the enemy oh the map's disappeared again <laughs> right, that's around the port so commander i visited castel di sangro recently and there's talk of a POW camp somewhere in the vicinity of Sulmona. Maybe abandoned, but it could be worth checking out. Right. I'm imagining that's probably going to get added to the list in a moment. Okay, we can take a, a unit of them out here. Hello. Prepare to phase annihilation. Right, now we're getting somewhere. Meanwhile, down here, how are we doing with this? So, uh,
I'm going to start pushing towards this breakthrough because that's really good. Uh, in the meantime, though, yeah, let's get on the march. Oh, we can nearly get right on to them now. Right. Next turn, they're mine. Speaking of which, finish these off. Job's good. Un. Uh, they're going to repair themselves. And we do need to destroy these guns, yeah. <coughs> okay. How are we doing here then? So we should probably annihilate these. Yeah. So, of course, these are like a super three star elite unit now. They absolutely shred everything. Okay. And here we have. Right, looks like we've got a town to take. Let's do some good, no enemy resistance around. Right, let's get started. Nice simple mission, get it finished, whatever it is, and then we've got the US Armoured Forces up in the north that are pushing through to manage. We should be getting an airport this turn if we, well, airfield this turn if we play our cards right. And since it's so close to the enemy lines, we should probably fill that airfield up with some actual bombers and things. Stuckers are going to be a problem unless we can capture some anti-aircraft weapons to deal with them. All right, gather around. Let's get this show on the road. Right. The Germans have been using this airfield to launch attacks on nearby troops. They need you to go in there and capture it. The Germans are going to be sending Stukas in to make life difficult. Unless you can take control of their anti-air guns, or build your own. We need both sides of the airfield, so you'll have to make your way across the bridge. You can expect heavy defenses at that point, so stay sharp. Alright, that's everything. Look, I'm thinking... Order. I mean, if we can build artillery, but I don't think we can with the paratroopers. Don't be fooled. This airfield may be small, but those defenses will pack a punch. Keep your eyes open for flat guns. What's the mission? Okay. Some bazookas. Right. Unit one. There'll be unit four, I guess. This will be unit two. That can go on three. Partisans are scouting enemy positions. Okay, so there's some nasty defenses there. There. It's not too bad. Oh, there's some big flat guns up there. So we probably want to assault that with infantry. And that's anti-infantry as well, so shelling this is probably the way to go. Right. And we want it on them. Get going. 
Airborne, probably the worst units to use on the airfield. Probably want armor for this, really. Would have been better off sending us artillery, actually, thinking about things, but... Yeah, right. Okay, they're pushed back. Run! Okay, our unit has gone down. Their Stukas are still up for the most part. Hit that. We've got some rockets. Right. Someone get that sniper. And this infantry here. So I don't want them moving in on my mortar. Okay, so taking this side wasn't that hard actually. Um, right, we've got that bridge to go over now. Okay. How to deal with that? Hmm. Gonna get a medical half track on the way up. Yeah, medical truck will get in get in position. We'll see what we can do with that. And in the meantime then, I think maybe a smoke bombing run as we push up, possibly. Might be an alright idea. That and some armor support, if we can get some. Might be an idea as well. Hmm. Let's see. We've only got 60, so if we could get a tank, we won't be able to... Yeah, we won't be able to have multiple ones. We can maybe get a tank. Um. What we may wish to do... Engineers on the field. Yeah, engineers. Enemy reinforcements incoming. What we may wish to do instead, now let's see, what can we make now? What we can do in the meantime is at the very least we can put these up. That should give us some extra munitions for callings and we can get some, get another one over here so we can get some more fuel to better call in uh, some tanks. Right. Is that medical? Yeah, there it is. It's, it's medical. We'll just have to... Yeah, even if you've toggled this on when it's got upgraded, you have to toggle it on again. It, like, disables it after the upgrade. Right. Do we even have the ability to call an anti-air? Not really. Uh, okay. Mind you, we can sort of do it. Can't we? So what we can do is, for example, grab this. Now we have an anti-air. Okay. 
Right, okay. Yeah, we can definitely use more resources at the moment. Oh. Shift. That's two. Go, go, go. Well, that's not good. Get him! Get these. Um, oh god, I haven't even got enough for additional grenades. Fire! Go, go, go! We need another grenade in. Um, on them, sure. Back off them there. Oh, 30 manpower, that's big. It's a big manpower point. Ooh. Right. Everything's moving up. And engineers can just sort of, you know, be here. That'll allow me to reinforce, yes. Big important one to take then, this. Okay. Is that a random donkey? There's a random donkey there. <laughs> Part of me wants to see what happens if like if you blow something up next to the donkey. Or is the donkey invincible? Mm, we've already killed a few troops there. Right. Doesn't matter though, they'll be blasted soon enough. God, what's hitting these aircraft uh, what's these paratroopers? So we're really they're dropping like flies against that just one unit. They're not gonna last long. Move, move, move. 
Oh no, aircraft. Get them. Okay, that hurt. I'll, I'll admit, that hurt. I don't know why they've not reinforced it. I guess they didn't get close enough to a car while we're down there. Right. Uh, satchel charge, I guess, then. Yeah, I think that destroyed the cover. Ooh, and two, and one, and gone. Right, that should be completely clear of enemies. Just about. Or not. Mortal landed on it. <laughs> yeah, we're taking it from him. Capture that area. Move. Where you can make sure that light got a twenty of that. Don't miss. Jump low, boys. Anytime. Come on, move your asses. So much for peace and quiet. All right, man. Stand by. Bring it up. Move your ass. Go. Relay orders. Right. Hit it. Right, we're gonna move back a bit. Uh, increase damage versus emplacements. Ooh, that sounds like what we want. Fuse, what's it? Delayed fuse high explosive, eh? Boop. The problem is we're not able to fully reinforce squads here now. We've not got enough troops got enough population on it right we might see if we can get this maybe if this armored car has an accident right what have we got here? Oh, hello. Get him.
Oh, it landed on one. Get him! No! No! How terrible! Now let's go and reinforce. Right. That should put all our squads to full. Are we nearly there? Reporting. Back up your gear, we're heading out. New recruits in. Rifles reinforced. Uh, we're up, boys. Private, we keep need that it, boys. Pay attention. Just enough. We we're got some place to drink, boys. <clears throat> right, we can't have that second day here then. Boys right, let's Don't push. Push, 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 push. Right, fill them with holes. He's actually doing something. Right. Let's push. There was a tank around here somewhere. That needs to definitely die. What's got me pinned? Ah, that. Okay, I see. Yeah, go there. Ow. Oh, look, it's firing final. <laughs> right, that should definitely do something. Oh, yeah, that's absolutely doing something. Okay. <laughs> I think that this should soon be ours. Just don't all get pinned at once, okay? Right, we'll unpin momentarily. Or not, because they're there. Wonderful. Get him! Alright men, we've got the airfield, but the crowds aren't gonna take this lying down. Get ready for a counterattack. Okay. Crowds are prepping a counterattack. 
We need to hold this airfield at all costs, so let's get a welcome committee ready for him. Oh, never good. That did a damn assault rifleman are gonna run all the way back to base. Wonderful. Right. And I've got a minute to prepare some defences. Excellent. This isn't terrible at all. Get over here. Oh, they're coming from there. Uh, are we... Yeah, there we go, finally. That way then. Um, I'm just like, try to make it back here sometime this year. Oh, it's finally given me a little bit more population cap, finally. Right, we're probably going to need to just, yeah, hammer this with uh, these anti-air guns. Now, luckily, we've got a few callings that we can use. Got quite a lot, actually, because it's the airborne. Right. Man that weapon. Right. Bring it with We've us. got enemy troops incoming, but reinforcements are on the way. We just need to hold the crowds off until help arrives. All right. Get out and stay ready. Go. Go, men, go. Engineers looking for trouble. You men, get ready. Come on, let's get this show on the road. Grasshopper recon on station. Oh, that's bad. We're losing a fuel point. And there's a tank and all that as well. Lovely. Right, we lost that anti-air, but we have got two of us, so it's not the end of the world. Um, let's try and get that over there. These can take cover here. Just blast into that general area. Enemy armor's almost here. We need to get those anti tank troops ready now. Yep, yeah, that's helped. Oh, that worked. Okay, here come the tanks.
Uh, let's not be stood in that fire. But let's use these Rex as brilliant cover. Bazooka squads, do your thing. Please. Please. Yep, they are doing good, 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 good. Okay. Well, we're not dead. So that's a bonus. Okay. Yeah, just smash all the cover that we were using there, Sherman, don't worry about it. Okay, you know, just both shoot. Yeah, that's that's definitely dead. <laughs> Unfortunately, we didn't get the secondary thing done here because I just stopped sending planes. I guess I just learnt the lesson eventually. Unfortunate for us. <laughs> right. Oh, they're not quite finished yet. Around here-ish. Oh, we're hitting them hard. Oh, and they're all concealed because they're in medium cover in these craters. <laughs> Bye-bye. Oh. Right, that's mine. <laughs> Yeah, we might have overkilled it, but it was fun. Very fun.
<laughs> Too bad they haven't sent any more planes, because we would have absolutely shredded them at this point, but... Oh well. So is that victory? Yeah, there we go. Good job, men. The airfield's ours. Let's get some rest. Yes, might need a bit of cleaning up first, but yeah. <laughs> I'm fairly certain we threw a number of grenades and incendiary rockets into the uh, control tower, but I'm sure it's usable. Right? <laughs> It's usable, yeah. We, we, we could use this. No problem. No problem at all. Just, you know, wax some our planes in there and... Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll be ready in no time. Okay, so that's the air, that's an airfield there that should be ours. I think we've got them pretty much backed into a corner here on this western pocket. Then we can push all of these units up north. So our western side will now have ooh, uh, two British tank support companies, a paratrooper company, an artillery company, and then in the north where they're uh, at the beach landing on Anzio, they will have two U.S. armoured companies that are also capturing an airport there. <clears throat> uh, yeah, 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 mm -hmm, yeah. I think I think we're gonna win. What do you reckon? <laughs> I think that's uh. We're we're definitely gonna be able to push this side back a bit. I think after that. Meanwhile, over in the east, on the eastern coast, we have, if I remember, we've got special forces, an armoured company, we've got the artillery over there as well, that are just mopping up those paratroopers, and we're probably going to be able to push them out of that port and then start hitting up north there. It might be a good idea once we've taken there, since we've got a bit of a lopsided attack at the moment, with far more guys going on to the western side. We might want to, in the east, send another company there. So we might want to purchase another one at the port or something once we capture it. Right. Just waiting for it to finish loading now. But that, I think that's probably the way we're going to handle things. Um, on that note then, let's see how things look now. They're not quite done yet, but they are on their way out. Yeah, they're getting forced right into the corner, right into a corner here. There's still plenty of units there though, enough that they can defend what they've got and send out some to attackers. So I have to keep that in mind. Um, these are accumulating a few skills now, so that's pretty good. Um, can get a better rocket strike, I think, here. Or where we're looking to purchase an, an upgrade of some sorts. Mm. No, I think we're all right. To, uh, upgrades, the, so we can either have... Upgrades a rocket strike to loiter the target area and attack nearby enemies, or get an additional plane. I think we'll go for the loiter, actually. Yeah. So it'll stay around and hit other things in the area. So if, it, if that first strike doesn't kill it, it'll just pursue them, basically. 
Um, okay. And what can we get here? We'll get the... Uh, yeah, Bobbyman. So we're going for like a full-on loiter, like aircraft loiter build here. So we can just have planes hovering around the battlefield, just blasting everything for us. Right. That's everything there. They've moved as well. Right. Good hit. Get them while they're weak. There we are. And when they can move again, we can get this uh, airfield. Excellent job. Right. Uh, I think that's everything moved then. Yep. Ooh, these are sandwiched. They're not going anywhere. So we'll have cut we'll have cut down both of their armoured companies that left the port. So we can really start hammering here now. I think that in another two or three turns we'll have that. I'm actually wondering if there is anything up in the east here. Or if it's all over to the west now, so maybe we don't need more uh, units over here. So it looks like it's a, just a big old mountain range, actually. Right. So we may not be needed to go there. We might be able to just start pushing west. Um, Where are we down here? Yeah, they've used March, so they can't do anything this turn, unfortunately. Yeah. That looks to be it then. Ah, we've got Prince Loyalty. Lovely stuff. So we're nearly on to Master Mats. They've nearly got everyone done up to full. And then we've just got all this to push through. And we're done. Once, of course, we've closed, the, closed these pockets. Yeah, it's just a all-out attack. Up to, and I don't know why this one isn't highlighted in big, you know, why you can't see it from the map when you zoomed out. But yeah, over here we have Rome, where all roads lead to. We've just got this big ass literal wall to get through first. Right, thank you very much for watching. I think that's going to do it for this episode. I'll drop a save here, and I will see you next time on Company of Heroes 3 for some more of the Italian campaign. I'll see you then.